win, obviously, because no team has ever come back from 3-0 deficit. And once a miracle happens, the Celtics will be back in the NBA Finals last time against the Warriors, in which they lost. Overall, um, they'll get Porzingis back. Game 4, maybe. Definitely Game 5 if they reach that point. So I feel very confident that with Porzingis, they will have a shot against the Mavericks. The Mavericks are going to be at Timberwolves. They're already up 2-0. The Mavericks took two games away, which are humongous games. And with them being back at their home court, they're going to win. They're going to win. They're going to win the series. So you're going to sit up with two teams, different teams, right? You got Celtics and the Mavs. Let's break down the Mavs team first. The Mavericks, obviously, are led by Luka Doncic. They also got Kyrie Irving as well. Again, they also they also are an offensive team, which was a problem when they, especially like other years when they didn't have enough defensive players. Now they got some. They got P.J. Washington. They got Gafford, Tim Hardaway. They started to build a little more the defense as well. Of course, Luka, he is a defensive player. He will bring though that big offensive ability. He'll share the ball well. He is a good rebounder. So he does have that ability. He's like um, Jokic, except he has a much better like movement and he can has a really good uh, step back and shoot, can shoot threes well. Kyrie is that second-air offensive player to add more potential for the offense, was it add last year? You already know what happened last year. P.J. Washington, though, I think it's a very big piece of them for defense. So I feel like Mavericks, what they're going to do, they're going to have to hope their defense, combined with their really good offense, is good enough to beat the Celtics. Because their defense is okay. But the Celtics have a bad defense. The Celtics consist of Tatum, Brown, Alan Horford, Holiday, White, uh, Porzingis, who's currently out. Uh, but they do have a really good team. If they can, I feel like the Celtics, right, they're obviously, they have a good defense, which will prove well against the Mavericks. They also got some offensive stars, Tatum, Brown, Horford. They got their offensive stars when they need them. As long as they can get Porzingis back, they'll be okay. But they can't get Porzingis, that will be costly because... I feel like the Mavericks, they, uh, the Celtics need that last defensive piece. And they can't afford seeing this. The Mavericks, they are a really good team. I'll admit that. But at the same time, I predict the Celtics will beat the Mavs in seven simply because they have a better defense. Their offense isn't as good, but they have a better defense. I think that'll be good enough to get them to win. So thank you for watching that video. Please subscribe.